Greetings and welcome back everyone to my Devil May Cry, Devil May Cry playthrough. When we last left off, we had just beat Mission 4. Watch down, watch something. We were watching something. And now we're in the main menu screen because we're going to be upgrading. That's the main reason why. I'm going to be upgrading the Rebellion mainly. This The, the Rebellion and the abilities are the, th the first things that I'm going to be going for. Press that and that. Just before, oh, that looks sweet. Oh, that looks even better. I'll take both of those actually. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so, that's all our upgrades done. How much until I get another- Oh, got 2,000, are you kidding? Ah, okay. Well, let's start the mission. I was here years ago as a child. I explored the whole facility unseen. I sensed a demon under the factory. The succubus. An ancient one. I believe it's the source of the psychotropic ingredient. That's what they use to control us. Welcome, visitors, to the Virility Factory. Virility's secret ingredient is what makes Virility the number one soft drink in the world. And best of all, it has been scientifically proven to improve weight loss by 21% and enhance sexual performance by 63%. If How do people daily. actually fall for this crap? If you're told something's true often enough, you tend to believe it told me I was crazy for seeing demons. Yeah. They tried telling me I was a basket case, too. They wanted to put me on drugs. Said it would make me better. They lied. They just wanted to keep me weak. Docile. How did you figure it all out? Virgil pulled me out of the nightmare. You? When the people you're supposed to trust most turn out to be demon scum, your eyes really do open up to evil everywhere. I took a stand, fought back, killed, no matter the consequences. So I chose my path and I lived by it. And after all that anger, violence, and death, you have to dig deep, deep into your own heart, to see if you are still sane. You can still call yourself human. I just knew in my heart I wasn't crazy. Dante, you're a Nephilim. You're not human, okay? Well, so, so you can't call yourself human because you're not. You're half angel, half demon. The succubus is hidden deep inside the factory, but there is no physical way to reach it from our world. Only from Limbo. There's a rift inside. Rest assured that it has been deemed both safe and beneficial by our trustworthy and ethical scientists. Okay, whoa, what was that? Oh, it's just some electrical sparks. I thought it was like a, a hidden gem or something like that. You know, Resident Evil 4 style. It's like, oh, a spindler or something like that. But no. Just this way, I think. Got it. You said you'd been here before. Yes, but it was during an out-of-body experience years ago. And flying around in spirit form. Yeah, in limbo. Virgil says it could be an effective intelligence gathering tool, but I can't do it at will. So, how did you do it before? It was triggered by extreme psychosomatic trauma. The nightmares. What are the nightmares? It's in the past now. Well, let's bring that horrible experience into the future, my dear. I want to hear all about your nightmares. What horrible things have made you who you are? That's what I'm interested in, my lady. So please tell me. I'm quite interested. This is where they store the merchandise ready for export. It's funny. What is? I expected it to be bigger. A lot bigger. But then, I was just a child when I was here, and I was in limbo. What are you doing here? Escaping my nightmares. You came to limbo to escape your nightmares? Yes. <laughs> I just love how casually they talk about Limbo, this horrible, 
transdimensional world or whatever it is. Once you're in limbo, all you have to do is retrace your steps back to the mixing room. Should be easy enough. Maybe, but the demons may sense you once you're in limbo, so stay alert. And once I've reached the mixing room? You'll be able to descend deep down into the factory. And kill me a succubus. Goddamn succubuses, they don't know what's gonna hit them. But it's rebellion, damn it. Gonna whip it good. Gonna whack it with the, the Arbiter, the Sirius. Okay, it's here. All right, see you on the other side. Down here. Oh, good. You're right. It's a lot bigger here in Limbo. What next? Head back to the mixing room. I'll meet you there. Got it. Obesity, stupidity, drink virility. Hey, I didn't know you were a freaking rapper guy. Th them rhymes, man. Them rhymes. They were amazing. Mm. You gotta teach me how you, how you rhyme so so fluently, so. Brilliantly, I just have to know your secrets, Dante, or should I say, MC Dante, because that's pretty much who you are right now. Let's across. It looks like this is just a platforming section to get us started. That's good. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. All right. Yeah, the platforming sections in this game—they they seem to just love them to bits. Uh, I'm I'm neutral towards them. I much pre I much prefer this type of combat and shit. It's it's my, it's definitely more my damn and such. It's just the, the platforming while they're what, oh there's fucking shield of pathos over here. Get over here, or I'll come to you. Fine, whatever. Whoa, shit! That fucking pathos. No, stop that. What are you doing? Look at you. Okay, now join me up here. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a nice little rebellion. <laughs> Didn't stand a chance. Okay, come out, you. Obesity, my favorite. Damn it, what the hell, Dante? Get up. But yeah, the platforming sections, while they're not my favorite part of the game, they're okay, and they, well, they serve their purpose. They just, they serve your purpose to travel around limbo and such, so, you know, I forgive them, I suppose. Oh, jump across. Oh, <laughs> barely made it, Dante, barely made it. Hell Knight. Death Knight, Hell Knight, Frost Knight. Would you point me to the mixing room? I don't think he cares about trying to help you, Dante. Whoa, the floor is lava. Jesus Christ, guy. Do not touch the floor when that's happening. Oh, wait, it already got me hit. Damn it. This freaking floor made me get killed. I hate you, guy. So much for trying to not get hit at all. You suck, guy. You really, really do suck. I freaking hate you so much right now. Come on, Ebony and Ivory. Help me out. Or just, you know, go, ah, shit, this guy. Okay, get up in the air. Thank you very much. You too. And goodbye. <laughs> oh, man, it's too easy. Throw it towards him. Oh, man, love it. Freaking this or Arbiter. I just love it so much. Oh, what's up, asshole? <laughs> Doesn't stand a chance. Have that, would you? No, get, die already. There we go, thank you. Oh, more guys for me to fight. Okay, well, whatever. Oh, shit. Shit, a Stygian, that's not good. Whoa, Jesus Christ, gotta watch out for him. Oh, let's pull him over. Get down here. There we go, thank you very much. Oh, doesn't, can't even handle me, man. Super sedit. Oh, how did I get down? I didn't even get hit. What the hell? Get over here. Path Whoa, hey there, Tubbs. What are you up to? Damn it. Maybe get hit. Damn it. Whoa, jeez. Stop that, stupid guys. I hate you. Gotta watch out for this tyrant as well. Oh, run into the tyrant. Aw, oh, damn it! Stupid tyrant, you didn't run into your stupid little pathos friend. Okay, fine. I can't use my freaking rebellion against him, so I'm just gonna have to use Ebony and Ivory, it looks like. Oh, come on, Tubbs. Oh, <laughs> didn't stand a chance, man. Didn't stand a chance. Oh, what's that? You gonna cry? You gonna cry? Is that it? Oh, I don't blame you, man. I'd cry if I had to verse Dante as well. He's too powerful, man. Too bloody powerful. Oh, can't handle me. Oh, come on. Let's charge, baby. 
Let's tango. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, missed me. Okay. Ah, damn it. I couldn't get him. Couldn't get him knocked over. Oh, there we go. That's what I wanted to happen. Ooh. <laughs> the freaking all arbiter. It's just. Oh, it's so good against those types of enemies. Oh, great. Now, how do I get over there? I'm not sure, but there's health for me around here, so let's take that. Thank you very much. Not that I need it that much. I mean. I have pretty much only got hit like once or twice, so it's not that bad, but hey, might as well just hold on to it for later, I suppose. What's this way? Anything interesting? Some hidden areas? No, doesn't look like it. But there are some spiders here that can, can kill for some red orbs. Thank you very much. Do I have any upgrades? No, I don't. Never mind. Don't even have enough to get that freaking upgrade thing that I wanted. Oops, wrong thing. Yeah, I can't have enough, don't have enough to get the uh, new health upgrade that I want the plus 10% health that is gonna be cool even though if oh no not enough copper keys damn it there was a copper key back there but I don't know how to get it all right let's go back this way and see if there's not a way I can just uh, find it no don't see a way to get across there so oh well looks like we're not gonna ever find out what's in there if you ever get this game and you have enough copper keys then go open that door and have fun but uh, have more fun than me because I don't know what it's in there like an anarchy shards, or demon shards, I forget what they're called. They're very anarchic in nature though, just trying to stop me. Stop the anarchy. The anti-anarchic is anarch, anarchy and king, whatever. I think they're actually demon shards. Damn it, you guys, get out of here. Same goes for you, mister. Oh, can't handle me, man. Oh, too easy. Now it's time for us to try. No, 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 damn it, no, 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 no. I'm gonna die. Oh well. You win some, you lose some. Oh, that's how. That's why it wouldn't let me get closer because I would have to pull it closer with the little this thing here, that little uh, random platform thing. That's why. Oh, oh, Dante, you barely missed it. Jeez, man, you're insane. Okay, get across here. Fucking hell, took forever to get rid of that guy. Oh, but it looks like I can actually juggle them with ebony and ivory. Oh, that's not too bad. Look at that. <laughs> you think I can just stand up there forever? Really? <laughs> oh, wow. This is ridiculous. <laughs> They're never going to come down, are they? Oh, yep. Okay, they finally got down. Jeez.